This is Twilio tip number one. What is a webhook? A webhook is a user-defined HTTP callback. What does that mean? It means if you want to know what's happening in a web service or application, you can give it a URL to let you know when that happens. For instance, when something happens in your Twilio account, Twilio can make an HTTP request to your web service at a URL that you have specified so that you know that it happened. For instance, a user sends a text message to your Twilio phone number. When this happens, Twilio will make a webhook HTTP request to the URL at your web server that you specified for incoming text messages. Twilio will pass in parameters about the message that was sent, including the from phone number that you could use to look up a customer record, or the body of the text message, which you could use to tell what the person texted into the number. Inside of the phone number configuration on Twilio, you can see the user-defined aspect of this. For both voice calls and messaging, you can see that there's a section for when a call or message comes in, and you can specify a webhook for each of these. You can also specify backup handlers for when the primary handler fails. These can all be set to webhooks. These are URLs within your web server that you would want to receive a post or get request at when the incoming message happens. That's the basics of webhooks. We'll dive into more of their usages in future tips.